project is a free routing. And free routing is a new concept that enables the airlines to fly routes outside the usual network. It means that they will be more efficient, more cost efficient. And so the, the objective is now to check if this concept is also working in terms of ATC air traffic control. It has to be tested in an international environment because free route is for all Europe. So it means that we have to work with our neighbors, with a FAB, a functional air space block. So it, it is necessary to test it in a large environment. That's why here in Skagai we have this capability with our simulator to perform large scale uh, simulations. The main challenge is for, at least for the ADCO, that today they work on a network with routes, design routes and so on, so they know the points, the navigation points and so on. And in this environment, the flight can fly almost everywhere. So it's not the same uh, management of traffic. So this is a big challenge. And we are testing this today with the adequate support tools for the controllers, the management of trajectory and so on. The goal of the simulation is to be able to decide what we can implement or not. So in this project, before implementing new procedures or new routes, we, it's really important to test those things in the simulator where the radar screens and the working positions are exactly the same as in the ops room. So like that, the environment is as close as possible to reality. So to create a simulation, we need um, to prepare well in advance all uh, the exercises, uh, the booking of the simulator, what we will need uh, as uh, traffic or airspace and uh, tools in the system. And then the goal of uh, this simulation will be really to, de to be able to decide what we can implement or not. <laughs> so in the simulator, which is really close then to reality, like in the ops room, we can uh, try new things, new procedures, new routes, and with the ad course working uh, like usual, then we collect the feedbacks and we can decide if yes or not, we can implement that uh, in real life. I'm a former air traffic controller. I'm working for the operations uh, department within Skyguide. And so I'm involved in this uh, single open sky and TM research program for five years now. I was in charge of uh, the coordination with uh, external stakeholders in the frame of this exercise. I mainly manage uh, the definition of the, the operational scenarios. It makes that we selected a specific time period of traffic uh, corresponding to a busy day in uh, 2014. And we asked the Flight Operations Center to uh, recalculate all these trajectories, uh, taking into account uh, the implementation of this uh, free route concept, of course and so the full factors of optimization in order to see what is the result in terms of trajectory. Today, uh, what is conducted is a validation exercise uh, part of the single European Sky uh, ATM research program. This exercise is called the VP797 free routing validation. And the objective of this exercise is to assess the operational feasibility of a new concept, which is called the free routing concept. This concept uh, corresponds to the ability for the airspace user to plan optimized trajectories defined according to airspace user segments instead of uh, published route segments. In the frame of this exercise, we are mainly focused on uh, ATC aspects in order to see uh, how the characteristics of this concept have to be defined or refined sometimes in order to make it acceptable and manageable. I'm here as focal point for uh, and of, uh, for the exercise VP797 of uh, CESAR. This exercise is very interesting because uh, as uh, our traffic controller we are going to see what he, which is the, uh, the request of the airspace user about the uh, direct routing. We are um, seeing the three sectors in Milano area, two sectors in uh, Swiss and uh, Geneva area and in Zurich area. So it's a bigger space and uh, we can uh, uh, see what will be the new, new trajectory and what will be the new issue for the air traffic control. 20% of my time I spend uh, working, assisting and uh, preparing simulations for CESAR. A simulation with free routes. Uh, basically, we asked airlines to recalculate uh, flights from last June 2014. Um, 
with the uh, permission that they could use any point available within the airspace and forgetting any all the routes that exist. Uh, during the exercise this week we performed this together with Zurich, Geneva and Milano West and East sectors. There we immediately saw that the, the trajectories flown are completely different from the standard route network. That hotspots which now are quite predefined due to the routes are completely shifting all over the airspace. That it creates um, much more traffic on certain airspaces, much less in others. Um, the layout of the sectors is not necessarily anymore the, the one we would need in, an, in this airspace structure. So after two days already we saw quite a lot of um, consequences and things to be looked at later on before one day we could be able to implement this kind of free trajectories.